Vendors at Coronation Market in downtown Kingston are upset that frequent power cuts are causing them to lose money. They're calling for the Kingston and St. Andrew Municipal Corporation to rectify the issue. TBJ Shamela Mitchell reports. It's Saturday afternoon at Coronation Market in downtown Kingston. Business happening, but there is a problem. They call over this side, all over this side, no light over this side. Left and right, no light. When it comes tonight, darkness. Vendors say the market has been without power since Tuesday evening. And coupled with poor maintenance at the facility, they are more vulnerable to thieves. They say the frequent outages have also turned away customers who are worried about their safety. When the criminal elements take them, do the drastic things, the people them are spread it and the people them out of the road are afraid for coming because when them hear the light now they and them say West Kingston and the war we are going, nobody never come, everybody afraid. Even last night they come in, they tap they don't have no light up there. And a man have put on a floodlight down there to make we could have get to see. Focus down here so that we could have see if we move around down. As you can see, God bless some buy and nothing to sell. Right now, see there, she come for your money. I'm not having enough money for PR. But still have to pay my stall fee because they not take no fee and answer. KCC need for the something about this. And there are other concerns. Vendors say the bathrooms have been out of use because there is also no water at the market. They say multiple complaints to the municipal corporation which handles payments to the Jamaica Public Service Company have gone unanswered. TVJ News sought a response from Town Clerk Robert Hill. The Jamaica Public Service Company is assisting the Kingston and St. Andrew Municipal Corporation in restoring electricity. Um, from preliminary reports, I have not had a hard copy as yet. There have been some issues on the supply lines and the GPS is feverishly dealing with it. Um, I should get a report hopefully by tomorrow. Um, they'll be dealing with it between today into tomorrow morning. Shamala Mitchell, TVJ News.